Oh no! It's happened again! Again! It looks like I have another Funko Pop here uh, that was poorly packaged, very poorly packaged. However, I am not that mad because this is a fake Funko Pop. Oh no! <laughs> I don't feel particularly proud of that, but yes, I bought a, a fake Funko Pop on purpose. Um, the reason being that this is the Jason Voorhees Unmasked, which, for those of you out there who do know, is, is just insanely overpriced and rare, and it's absolutely ridiculous. So, you know, I've, I've, seen, I've been seeing these copies for so long, and there's a lot of fake Funko Pops out there, unfortunately. It is a thing. Um, and... A lot of times these can be very inexpensive. A lot of them come from, you know, China and so <laughs> it seems to be pretty beaten up. Luckily, I paid almost nothing for this. Wow. Okay, let's have a look. A closer look. Uh yeah. For those of you who know or don't know, uh this the original, like if if it was a real it's insanely valuable, and uh, I've seen it go into the $500, $600. Uh, might be even worse than that or less, but anyways. Uh, okay, so this is really beaten up. Luckily, like I said, I, I paid next to nothing for that, and it looks like I got some pretty awful shipping um, for the price I paid. <laughs> so I'm, I'm not even mad, honestly. This was just... Uh, I, I thought I would get this for my collection. I have all the other Jasons, like the Part 2 Jason. Uh, I have the one with the, the regular Part 3 hockey mask. I have the fake, uh, you know, the, the Part 5 Jason, Roy. Uh, so this was the one I was missing, and I was like, well, might as well. And uh, Let's even have a look at it. I'm sure it's not even... Uh, I don't even care at this point. <laughs> Just let's go open it up, and who the hell cares at this point? Um, okay, now, I'm sure if you were to search online, you could see, I'm sure there's a, a whole bunch of differences. What does it say here? It says, Funko, okay, dot com, made in China, LLC 2011. Uh, hmm, I don't know. To tell you the truth, I just don't really know. I'm not that... Uh, I don't have that much knowledge on Funko Pops and fakes in general, but I'm sure a lot of people out there, those who know, they could tell me like, oh, look at this, look at that, look at this, little details, probably in the packaging as well. There has to be uh, a lot of stickers, probably fake as well, you know. Uh, but yes, this was an extremely limited edition, as you can see, and uh, the real one <laughs> is insanely expensive. So, you know what? I'll just take this. I'll put a plastic protector over it. It probably won't show too much. And it's a bit shame shameful. I'm not very proud of it. But you know what? I mean, I hate to encourage fake stuff like that. Uh, but I am also not about to drop $500 on one of these. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyways, guys. Let me know in the comments. Did you ever purchase a fake Funko Pops by mistake? Uh, do you have any good tips maybe that you could tell people? Uh, leave them in the comments if you have any good tips on how to avoid fakes or how to spot them, you know. Uh, obviously, what I would say is on eBay, be very careful if you're purchasing online. Uh, make sure that you always have access to real, actual pictures, not, not stock images, you know. Uh, but yeah, I knew what I was getting into, obviously, with this guy right here. And uh, this is on me. <laughs> uh, yeah. Anyways, take care, guys. I'll see you very soon for some more horror-related videos. A lot of skits coming up, a lot of Michael Myers stuff, obviously, with Halloween coming up. So take care, guys. I will see you very soon. And as always, peace.